Okay, so today it was an overcast day. I think it got up to almost 80 degrees. Um, wasn't a bad day. A little warm, wasn't humid, had the wind. Um, I'm thinking tomorrow is supposed to be um, close to 80. Saturday and Sunday are supposed to be warm. Monday is supposed to be even warmer. get asked this question a lot. Do female dogs train or behave differently than male dogs? I don't see that. Uh, I don't look for it. I don't see it. Um, the sex of the dog, to me, the only difference is the females are generally smaller than the male dogs. But as far as the training and their comprehension and their tasks, um, I don't see a difference. Uh, da, 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 da. Today was a productive day. I think everything got done. We are now feeding the puppies three times a day for a little while anyways. Um, so you'll probably start seeing us, well, we have been for the past couple days. So that would usually be, well, tomorrow will be Olivia and Megan. We're practicing recall and name IDs, getting them ready. dog's birthday? Hmm. Somebody's singing happy birthday in the background. We don't know whose birthday it is. <laughs> um, let's see. Who was my star today? I would say that was probably Ella. Ella did very good today. Ella seems to be getting back on track. She just needs some more miles, more exposure. She'll be ready shortly, hopefully. Yeah, that's their potty room. I haven't really dealt with Penny or Paula other We're than- We're talking outside, good potty, come other on. Other than- Come on. Um, when I come up here for trainer talk, I don't really see them that much. The poos are finally divided up into twos, and one. except for Bear. Bear is by himself. Aww. Soon tomorrow it'll be Rabbit instead, so we can boy girl it. Do puppies get routine baths? That's a good question for Carlene. spot is that the deal you got a little spot under there watch my wheels that's her kennel space yeah is that where you guys sleep let's have fun i could not figure out how to send those i took picture but i couldn't send it i smell food that's a good thing what's going on anything interesting Pushy Penny, she's got a rolly tummy too. 
Give them a little tiny poke. Are you a good pony? I don't think, I think your head is smaller than that. Than what's her name? Paula's. Don't you bite me! Thank you. Good. We don't have any mail at all. Whose birthday? Bentley on the thirtieth. Oh, okay. We're singing happy birthday. Uh, Alexa was. Oh. It's fun. Alexa, sing happy birthday. Who is singing happy birthday? I don't know, just because it's fun to do. Happy birthday to you. I know, so it might be someone's birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Oh, gosh. <laughs> <laughs> That's, That's awesome. Right, it is. That's awesome. Where's the documentation? That's right, it is. You took the day off today. sure that wasn't in there before just now was it now there's a hole there what happened she put a hole in your pants put a hole in the seat, hole in the seat. you're lucky it was the seat i guess <laughs> Could have been worse, I suppose. gold option engine transmission Uh, do Charlie and Bentley get along? Let's just say Charlie and Bentley don't hang out together. We could have them both in here if you and yeah. I were here. Yeah, right. We'd have no trouble. Yeah. In a controlled environment, they would probably be fine. Well, they can't hang out at the bar together. No, they can't be running around. Your records indicate you're fine that they're due to be updated. Please call. They habla espanol. Your factory warranty will expire or may have already expired based on the mileage. No, I doubt that. You hardly ever drive it, right? Age and whatever. By neglecting right. to replace your coverage, you will be at risk, financially liable for all sorts of things.
Hello. Hello. Okay. So they put gas in the purple building. Oh, here we go. $232.69. That basically is to do the laundry. Is this your phone? Yes. Oh, just wanted to make sure it wasn't theirs. Hmm. They last gave it to us 510. 84 gallons. It's 86 gallons. Hmm. Okay. Go give that to Linda. Okay. Where's the bag? Where's the bank? Where's the bottle? Oh, it's over here. <coughs> okay, we we'll do that. And we have Harold and Wanda. Harold? I'm glad we have Harold and Wanda because we didn't have anybody else. That's pretty slim pickings. Okay. Thank you, Harold and Wanda. Whoops. Okay, there goes that one. That's all not very exciting. And then we have a water bill. Oh, here we go. $27.70 for the bottle of water. Okay. We have an energy surcharge of four dollars and sixty-four cents, and a paper invoice fee of three bucks. So we have seven dollars and sixty-four cents. I think we should stop this. We ought to be able to pick this stuff up ourselves, no? <coughs> Anybody listening to me? They're charging us 10 bucks for a bottle of water, the big bottle, the five gallon. Is anybody listening? Linda? Linda. You listening? Did she go out? Did she already? Maybe she went out. Did she go out? Are all the dogs gone? The water bill. I'm not. Yeah. I'm not happy. What is it? It's ten dollars for a bottle for a five-gallon jug, right? And then it's energy surcharge of four dollars and sixty-four cents, and a paper invoice fee of three bucks. So now we got seven dollars and sixty-four cents. Okay. For a bottle of water. <laughs> That's got to stop. Just throw it in there. We don't need to do. Well, we got to stop that. Yeah, yeah, just put it in the jug. Okay, you're going to tell them to stop delivering? Yeah. Good. That'll be the end of that. I mean, we have large cars. We can put jugs in cars. Yeah, and we usually have do the, bo the Costco bottles. Yeah. Well, those are more expensive, I'm sure, but it's at $7, and, you know. Yeah, and $3 for a paper statement. Paper statement. Yeah, that's terrible. Yeah, we don't need that. Okay. I don't know. Here we go. This looks like trouble. This is that Sam Keys again. He's having a good time buying stuff for us. 
which is good. She bought some good things for the interns. I don't know what this is. Okay. What have we here? that torn apart. something or other, polyester. Huh, okay, well there's that one. And all of they, they're feeling the same, they're feeling like they're the same kind of thing here. There's another purple one. Are you gonna pick up all these papers after I throw them on the floor? Yeah. Another one. I'll open one more and see whether we have any variation. If we have a bunch, we can put a bunch out here. One, two, we have a lot of these. Get out of here. What's in the other? Is the other one the same thing? Person. Okay, so you can have that. Thank you. And I'll put this here, and then we'll see what this is. Okay. Okay. This is in a, a bubble bag. This one's different. Gloves. She said she was going to send gloves. I think these are for the interns. Utility gloves to go in your toolkit. Cool. Cool. That's right. I bet we got six. One, two, Oops. four, six. There you go. There we go. That's from from Sam Keys again. Thank you very much. They'll enjoy those. I'm not too sure what they're supposed to do with these ones, but that's, let's open another one of these and make sure that there was one that felt different. Yeah, we can open this one. That's different colors. I guess we better open some more. <laughs> here, uh, but I'll pile them up right there. And then they could go in there. You can open some if you'd like. Oh. Another gray. Baby fluffies. Baby fluffies. All right. Another purple. Another purple. Okay. Another 
Another gray. Another purple. This is a big one. How did your class go today? Um, kids. Good. They like were very excited to poop pick. Wasn't that fun? Yeah. Okay. Um, they were very interested. They didn't ask a lot of questions though. So. Okay. But they didn't complain, so mm -hmm. I'm happy. Well, if if you get if you get a lot of questions, you know you've begun to pique their interest. Yeah. So that, as a speaker, that's what you try and do is to try and encourage people to ask questions. And once you get them started asking questions, they usually ask more. We had a bunch today who wouldn't show up. <laughs> I was with a bunch of second, third graders. I don't know what, I don't know what, they were awful small. And I think mine were English second language or they were trying to learn English or something. I've forgotten what exactly. They were very good at that. And they got all wound up around poker chips. Because they didn't, all of them being foreign or children or something, didn't know what poker chips were. We got all tangled up in that for a while. Is this one from today? No. Okay. We've done that one. We're done. There wasn't very much today. Yeah. Mm. Two okay. people. Two, two, <laughs> two people, right, okay. Okay. Thank God for Harold and Wanda. Oh, this is apparently for expecting Lainey's puppies. How many, how many we got? We, did you count them? Oh, the babies. And apparently that's what? How many, how many pink? Four. So she's expecting four girls and four, five. And five boys. Four girls and five boys apparently is what Sam is expecting. Oh, oh wait, what happened? Wait. Five and five. Oh, five Sorry. and five. I put one on mm. uh, Paula. Haley, would you mind being me tonight for the walk later on? Alright. Thank you. What is she doing? She's gonna look. They're all ready to go, and I can't take them. Oh. So she, Haley's gonna take them. I will take them. them on a walk later. Thank you. Haley's gonna take. Well, them. you can do that now, and I'll just read the questions. Okay. How many puppies? Uh, okay, we got five and five. Cocaine? What? Baby fluffies. Sam, well that is a joke. Those are supposed to be fluffies. They are tiny little fluffies. Mini fluffies. I it's one of those things. It could be it could be Goldie that's done that. We're going to have five girls and five boys apparently from the breeding that we just did. Hey. What? Does she want to be no reason. No reason. Just do four. Bye. Bye. You're not walking. Okay. We'll figure that out later. You didn't break anything, did you? No, no. Hang on. Come on, kid. We're going. Slobber cloth perfect. Let's go. Go. Where are you? Run inside the door. Baby fluffies. Come on, come on, come on. We're supposed to be five purple and five gray fluffies. Honey, they shrank the fluffy. <laughs> That's pretty funny. We're working on the on the splicing. Yeah. 
Yeah, I'm not happy about that. Okay, I think we I think we have enough. Okay, these are all Steve things now. Oh, here's six more. I talked to a <coughs> donkey rescue near me and asked about their flies. She said she uses something called fry predators. Says it's effective. If that's what I think it is, it's something that you put in the horse's food and it goes through their gut and out the other end and therefore the flies don't hatch. And if that's the case, if that's what these are, I tried them a long time ago and what I found was that I had fewer flies but I had birds walking all over the place that couldn't fly and I associated the two and so I have not used that product since. Carly's day, did I do any training? I, we took two dogs to a school for a very long time. It was the biggest school I've ever been in in my life with great long hallways that I had to walk down <laughs> and I had to walk up the stairs. They did let me come down in an elevator, which was wonderful. Um, they didn't realize I was having problems. It was a huge stair, double staircase. And uh, that's what I did. Sir Bentley's interested in sizzle. Well, it would be very nice. I don't. I don't know. If I've ever posted the video. I, I have no objection to posting the video. It's, it's a fact that happened. Um, other than the fact that I really don't know how to post the video. I don't know. I'll 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 check it with somebody. I don't. Find a website reviewed. I don't know how to do that. Sir Richard is with Megan's friend Megan, and he should be coming back here on you know a couple three times a week. I have been watching the Broadway show movies. Yes, they do work. Those were DVDs. How is the arena smelling? I haven't had a smell report lately. Somebody said it was slightly better. And that's all I know. Is that all I have to do? <laughs> Thanks to whoever sent me that book on guide dogs. I'm having a good time reading it. <coughs> That's what I wanted to do in the first place was train guide dogs. How do you bathe all the dogs? We don't. Um, we don't. We brush them if they need it. Um, I do happen to like that waterless shampoo uh, you put that on a washcloth and just wipe them all down, and that really does an awful lot to freshen them up. Um, we certainly do wash them if they get in the mud of the pond. Uh, and where we wash them, down, you could see it from the Puppy Hill camera if they turn the camera sideways. Um, we wash them outside the laundry building on that table. And it's something that they ought to learn to do anyway. Um, but we don't wash them routinely. What's for dinner? Cindy's here, so it's a surprise. Chicken with teriyaki glaze and a baked potato. Chicken with teriyaki glaze and baked potato. And some lima beans and salad if you would like. Salad and lima beans, that'd be good. Okay, oh, two more here. Yep. 
There you go. That Okay, so you got the dinner report, so it's time to cut it off now, okay? Good night, everybody. And nobody reported that they could hear the microphone last in the last 24 hours. I will do that again. If anybody can hear us talking after I shut this off, please let me know, because I'm actually unplugging the mic. Bye. We'll do all